Growth is never by mere chance. In 1975, Mr. Lim Hua Min acquired a broking firm using his personal savings and a loan from a bank and his father. Christening it Philip Securities as it was on Philip Street, Mr. Lim, executive chairman of Philip Capital Group, nurtured that company into a powerhouse in finance. Today, Philip Capital Group of Companies is an integrated financial institution offering a multitude of financial products and services in 17 countries. Huamin is a firm proponent of uh, technology. He introduced Poems, which is the first internet uh, uh, stockbroking facility in Singapore, actually probably in Asia. And uh, he has grown that to a, a very uh, robust business. We were probably the third in the world. But at that time, I guess, uh, that gave us a lead over all our competitors, uh, at least for two or three years at least. Sensing opportunities abroad, Mr. Lim steered the company to expand overseas and strived to be a one-stop financial hub for its clients. Phyllis has been a long-standing partner with Income over the years. And I think this is born out of a shared agenda in our wish to provide a comprehensive wealth management solutions for our customer. We have to be customer centric. The customer doesn't just want a single product. Uh, if we can deal with you in a comprehensive range of things, sort of a multi product, multi channel sort of methodology. And so uh, we took our time, and over the last 40 years, we just grew. Today, Philip Capital has over 3,500 employees with 1 million clients globally. Its assets under custody or management total more than 30 billion US dollars, with shareholders' funds in excess of 1 billion US dollars. We always uh, strive on few principles, uh, people before things. So whatever we do, we make sure that it is good for the customer, good for our salespeople, and then good for the company. I think that's one of the reasons why increasingly we have that brand and that trust. And there are two things that strikes me about Mr. Lin in terms of his leadership is that firstly, he's a visionary leader. He often say to me, as one of the pastors, he says we must see how we not only grow big in our bigness, but we must also watch how we grow in our smallness. But the second V I give to you is that he's also a value-driven Leader. He was led by very clear principles that undergird the values that he embraced that he lived up in his life. Over the years, Mr. Lim has made numerous contributions to Singapore's financial market. In 1997, as chairman of the Stock Exchange of Singapore's Review Committee, Mr. Lim helped craft recommendations, laying the foundation for Singapore's capital market to be more robust and able to compete globally. For his contributions, Mr. Lim was awarded the Public Service Medal in 1999 by the Singapore government. We are proud to have Hua Min as our alumnus. He held several senior positions with us. In the end, he was chairing a committee that would make the Singapore Exchange more global, competitive and robust. Uh, we were fortunate to be a Singapore-born company. And we were fortunate to be Singaporeans. When you build a company, it's all about people. I thought that the only right thing to do is to make sure there is a good succession. Two, exactly two years ago, we have created our Team A. Every one of them are in the age of 35 to 45. And the whole idea is to create a continuity and grow an enterprise. In 2015, Futures and Options World website awarded Mr. Lim with its Asia Lifetime Achievement Award, highlighting Mr. Lim's efforts to build Philip Capital into a global enterprise that operates across a number of business classes. Under Mr. Lim's leadership, Philip Capital Group received top honours at the Share Investor Awards in 2017. Despite Philip Capital's success, Hua Min is a very low-key and humble person. When you look at his company, uh, he doesn't publish the results, but we did our own estimates. And based on the results, if you take a very modest PE of 20, you'll find that his company is worth well over a billion dollars. So we are waiting anxiously for Hua Min to list his company on SGX soon. I think life is all about trying to be a blessing to others. So the only thing that keeps me going is to see the joy of 
some of these young people blossoming. Even at my late stage in career, uh, I'm still spawning uh, enterprises. So I guess the next uh, benchmark for us is working on being completely, really a global uh, company.